something with tequila, right? Absolutely. So we're going to do a, a, a sour. So a traditional okay. sour is actually made with uh, egg white. Um, you know, I, I've had a lot of customers that have been a little weary about egg whites in their cocktails. Um, it's fine. It really just gives it a beautiful texture and um, just it makes an amazing cocktail. It's definitely a wow factor. I, I see it like. All right. So we're going to do a little bit of agave syrup. Do a half ounce of that. We're going to do an ounce of grapefruit juice. Because it's Texas, we use some ruby red. Ruby red, of course. Ruby red. Um, and then a little bit of lime juice as well. I'm going to bounce out that city. About a half an ounce. Yeah, yeah okay. exactly. And then uh, about two ounces of tequila. It's a nice pour of tequila. Yes. Good for a shot, but in this case, we're making a sour. Correct. Uh, so on, on sours, you want to have the ice in first before you actually put the egg white on top. And this will keep the uh, citrus from actually slightly cooking the egg white. So you, uh, and it helps out the flavor and aroma of the cocktail. So, you know, I just pass it back and forth until you get that egg white. And then a healthy shake. I'm gonna strain this one. Yeah, definitely strain it. Look at that beautiful color. And then I actually like to give the foam just a couple minutes to set before I garnish. A little tap every once in a while helps break the bubbles down at the bottom and thickens up the foam up top. And then just a little dot of Angostura on top for garnish. I mean, this could be a great morning time drink, I think, if you're at a Absolutely. brunch. This would be great Perfect. to serve to all your girlfriends or your, or your friends that are coming over for a nice brunch on a Sunday morning. Cheers. Check out our recipe on hewineshedines.com.